Bonjour tout le monde. Pour la prochaine 15 minutes, on va parler en anglais. Hello everybody. Welcome to another edition of Heidi Small in the Kitchen for Trudeau Kitchenware. I am now calling myself for today the Italian Mama. For those of you who may not know, I am definitely a proud Canadian, but in my heart, I am a true Italian lover. I could pretty much eat pasta every single day. But being that I also have to be mindful and of course healthy, I have three children to watch over, I have always thought about the idea of this spiralizing everybody was talking about and that you can substitute pasta for zucchini and eggplant and really make it a beautiful experience without every night heavy on the pasta. So with the help of Trudeau Cuisine, I got my accoutrement and I'm very excited to do a little Italian mama little cooking segment for all of you. Now, of course you can't go Italian without a little bit of vino. So bear with me as I get a little red wine ready for our beautiful lunch. And uh, this is probably the best wine opener I've ever had. And I have this magnificent decanter. Now listen, I am no expert at anything. So if any of you sommeliers are watching, I apologize if I'm not doing it perfectly perfect, but that's who I am. I am a perfectly imperfect person in the kitchen. I'm messy, it's real, I am a mom. We are all just doing the best that we can. So I will let this find its way for a little bit. Thank you to Trudeau, I have beautiful stemware. So I'm just gonna let that breathe and talk about the chopped salad. So as much as I like to be healthy, I am very lazy in the kitchen in that I need to be inspired. So as I've been saying, these kitchen gadgets are helping me want to do better for me, for my family. And making salad, you can ask anybody, I'm like, nah, we don't need salad. But now I just got this incredible chopper that is not like schlepping out the Cuisinart and all of that heavy stuff. I'm not interested. I want life to be easy. So I did this beforehand. I chopped up some beautiful, beautiful market fresh vegetables and voila. So you see how beautiful, how perfect, how colorful. So I'm going to take my gorgeous bowl. Of course, everybody take the blade out. And I like to use my hands and get a little dirty. So this is my beautiful chopped salad. And just to also let you know, I have this little mini chopper. I don't like using garlic. So I just love radish for color, for texture, for crunch. Do a little of that. And as well, of course, messy over here. Oh. Okay, I have this wonderful gadget that I had asked for because I love to have fresh herbs in my kitchen at all times and it just makes it fun. Do you know what I mean? Like when you have all of these beautiful, beautiful, helpful utensils in the kitchen, it just makes everything better. It makes it taste better. So I have a little bit of fresh basil, a little fresh mint, a little fresh cilantro, that looks gorgeous. These scissors are magnificent. As well, lemon. I have always wanted a little lemon twister. This is amazing to just add a little bit of flavor. Beautiful. One of the most coveted things that I have received from Trudeau is the salt and pepper shaker. I cannot tell you how many people have come over and tried to steal this. No. I have a little bell if anybody tries to leave my house. What's so cool? One size fresh salt, one size fresh pepper. Heaven. Okay. A little olive oil, a little balsamic, all in the same place. Okay. A little drizzle. Beautiful. A little here. Beautiful. We're going to come back to the salad because I would really like to pour myself a glass of red wine. 
before I take you into the next section, this beautiful red. <sighs> Salud. Mm. Mm. That's good. Okay, I'm gonna bring you all very carefully into the next section. Okay, so I just want you all to know that I, I did a little bit beforehand because I needed to, I was too excited. This spiralizer, look at this gorgeous, gorgeous zucchini. I mean, I may give up pasta for this. I'm pretty damn proud of myself because I am a bit of a nerd and I didn't sleep all night worrying about how I would learn how to do everything because I'm not very technical, but I have to tell you, and I'm gonna, I left this beautiful eggplant. It's so beautiful and easy to do. I mean, this is like the Play-Doh set that we all dreamed of when we were little. And I have to say, when I had my kids, I did buy the Play-Doh set to do stuff like this because I get a certain perverse thrill out of all of this. It is beautiful. Okay, so I'm gonna add the zucchini. And sorry, this is eggplant. I'm gonna add the eggplant to the zucchini. And I just can't begin to tell you that this is a game changer. It is going to change my life in the kitchen. Okay, this is a very intuitive dynamic cooking segment because I've got a lot going on. So just to tell you, I have beautiful fresh garden tomatoes. Yes, I grow them in my garden to pretend like I'm living out on a farm. That's on low. Over here, what I'm gonna do, because I, I am a real simplistic eater, and when you have beautiful ingredients, you don't need a lot. So I'm going to heat up a little bit on the magnificent skillet and add a little bit of olive oil. Okay, a lot of olive oil, who am I kidding? Here's my other little trick I've learned from a few incredible chefs. You put fresh chili flakes in the olive oil while it's heating up. It flavors the olive oil from the beginning and I like things spicy. So we're gonna do that while that heats up. I'm gonna take this magnificent bowl of heaven sent spiral pasta. And you, I've spoken to a few chefs about this. You don't, they all said, Heidi, don't overcook in any way. It doesn't need a lot. It's almost as if you blanch it. It's um, a very, very easy, it, it's like you're warming it up. You wanna just warm it up beautifully, just for the taste and the texture. It already smells immediately magnificent and beautiful. And the Italian mama in me is coming out in all forms. So I just, have to take you back for a second. This is a little bit of a walkabout because I left my wine, sorry. Okay, I'm gonna put you back down and tell you mm, that this is the best thing that's ever happened to me. Everybody in my family has said it's been a game changer. Sorry, a little noisy. So this is nice and ready and it is like the perfect al fresco eat outside summer dish. And now I'm healthy girl and I don't have to worry. I made this beautiful, easy, fresh tomato, homemade, you can see. Beautiful, beautiful, fresh tomato sauce. So typically I would be doing this over pasta almost every other night for my kids. It definitely, they say, gets a little bit boring, but what can I tell you? I am not perfect. I try to be, but I'm not. Something else I really love is um, lemon zest. I like having lemon zest on my fresh pasta, so I'm going to do a little lemon zest. Beautiful. Look at that. Oh, that looks good. Okay. Then I am going to stay right there. 
my salt and pepper. Hi. Salt, pepper. Ooh, this looks good. Okay, I'm going to take you very carefully now. And I'm going to be like every mother and multitask like crazy and put you down over here. And I am going to dig in to what looks like the most magazine. Oh, hold on, hold on. I want to cut some fresh basil because no Italian dish should ever go without fresh basil. I can smell everything. <gasps> so good. I wish you could smell it too, but you can watch me eat it and then make it at home on your own. Okay, one second. I need a little fork, a little spoon. Okay, very excited. This is very beautiful and even more magnificent than I could have even imagined. I have to give myself a little pat on the back because I was super nervous. Mm. Mm. It's, <clears throat> it's too big of a bite. It's magnificent. <clears throat> I think I need a little wine. <clears throat> manja, manja. That <clears throat> is wild. It was a little spicy, I'm not gonna lie. Those chili flakes got stuck. Anyhow, thank you for joining me. This was Italian hot mama in a sweaty kitchen. We didn't even actually try my beautiful chopped salad, which I just want to take a little bit of a taste before I let you go. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. Delicious. Thank you, thank you Trudeau, making me not only a kitchen goddess, but the Italian mama I have always wanted to be. Thank you everybody for joining me. This was truly magnificent. I'm gonna finish my wine, finish my spiral pasta. Have a beautiful, beautiful day.